5.55 in the morning. I wake up, brush my teeth, realize I forgot the toothpaste. I'll actually brush my teeth. Take a shower, get ready. Throw together some breakfast, nothing special. I begin my commute, and I end my commute. When I attend my classes, I'm usually the first one there. I use this time to do some homework. When class is over, I leave, I go home, I relax, and then finish whatever homework I had left, and then I go to sleep. This has become my average weekday cycle for the first semester at IPY. It is certainly not the most exciting lifestyle, but it is the necessary one if I wish to become a professional engineer. From childhood to young adulthood, building, creating, experimenting, and repairing items gave me the love I have for mechanics. It seemed to me that the perfect fit for my interests and personality was to go to college and study engineering. After graduating high school and entering the mechanical engineering program at IEPY, I expected the worst. Horror stories of impossibly difficult classes, weed out courses, endless piles of homework, lack of females, filled me with unsettling anxiety. But after an entire semester, I can honestly say that those stories were only 80% correct. In the Engineering 195 course, one of the first things we were briefed on was time management. In addition, new friends showed me tips on organization and I later found most of my classes to be surprisingly manageable. Before I knew it, I was sharpening my mathematical skills, learning new modeling software, chemical concepts, and revolutionizing my writing skills. I did not expect to be doing so much writing as an engineering college student, but ever since enrolling in W131, I have become exponentially better in my reading, analyzation, and writing skills. According to a test I took in Engineering 195, analyzation is one of my strong suits, and to be able to improve upon that through writing will certainly aid me in my future career as a student and professional. I would still consider myself an amateur writer, but as I continue through different classes, I'll use my skills I learned this semester to continually improve myself. In both Engineering 195 and W131, there was a lot of self-reflecting that made me think about myself as a person. Particularly in 195, we evaluated how we could utilize our newly found strengths in society. As future professionals, we have a civil obligation to use our skills to help others get back on their feet. To test this, we were assigned to volunteer in underprivileged schools, as well as design little libraries to donate to the younger kids. During the designing process, I observed my group members and my own habits. My personal qualities emerged when working together. With winning in mind, we had brilliant ideas on how the project would be constructed. My attributes as an arranger, innovator, and commander combined with the other's strengths amplified our aspirations. However, our group inexperience made for a less productive project than anticipated, and we ended up finishing on 11 p.m. on the last workday. Not to mention, of course, that my drive to complete the assignment almost froze my lab members to death in a cold garage, but at the end of the day, we were happy with the outcome. My first semester at IEPY, I have learned a great amount academically and socially. While my time here appears routinely insipid at first, it has actually been a thrilling experience. Every day, I look forward to learning new concepts and ideas to add to my ever-expanding road to professionalism.